started with things that were easy to appreciate, like the ocean and the moon and the sun and flowers and trees and little kids that I knew that I loved and dogs and cats and things. I started with those easy things to appreciate. But even as I was appreciating those things that were easy, that had nothing to do with my body, my body started to feel better. I used to have chronic pain, and because I've been focusing on things I appreciate and things I love, I have chronic pleasure, <laughs> which is really nice. I had one time, I, um, I had gone to a doctor because I had something that um, I was concerned about, and she said, it's melanoma, you need to have it removed. And I had an appointment to get the melanoma removed, but when I was at the grocery store, I ran into another doctor that was a friend of my girlfriend's, and he said, you have melanoma. And I said, I know. And I said, I'm going to get it removed on Tuesday. And this was a Friday. And he said, no, you have to do it tomorrow. He's like, it's really dangerous. You need to have it done tomorrow. He goes, I'll do it. I'll do it for you. And I was like, all right. <laughs> and I, I went home and um, I meditated on something that was really soothing to me, something that felt really soothing to me. And I meditated pretty much all day and in the night. And whenever I woke up at night, I would meditate on this feeling that was really soothing and expansive and soft and felt really good. And when I woke up in the morning, it was gone. And it wasn't like it, wasn't like it was gone, that there was you know, a scab or something like that. It was gone. There was no sign that I'd had anything on my face. And I called him and I said, it's gone. And he said, I don't believe you. And I said, well, it's gone. And he said, come down anyway. And I did. And he was like, I've never seen anything like this before. <laughs> and it was literally because I'd put myself in a soothing, soft, relaxed place. So my body knew what to do. My body knows I want to be healthy.